and say, girl, you better take care. Cause that man is trouble, you best be away. And go deep down, I know I might be headed to teardrops. Now that you got me started, I just can't stop. No, you Welcome back, y'all. Uh, we've been busy, vacations and stuff like that. But uh, we're trying to get this Maverick done for Fabulous Fords Forever, which is June 13th. So, Tess and I are gonna try to button up the last few things on this car just to get it to where it's uh, gonna run. So, I'm gonna take you around real quick and show you what we've accomplished. You'll see it if you've watched the last video, but we'll just do a quick little walk around and show you. As you can tell, the motor is back in the car. Um, got the carburetor over there from Lunchbox, from the Carburetor Chronicles. If you guys haven't watched their channel, watch it, follow it. At uh, any rate, a uh, few things to button up in here. No, nothing major, nothing big. We also have the T5 transmission in, out of, obviously out of a box body. Um, trying to get, the guy made a homemade mount for this deal and we're trying to get the right mount, rubber mount. Uh, so we can get this thing buttoned up, get the drive shaft in. I'm gonna start working on getting the starter in. Trans needs to be filled up with fluid. And, uh, you know, just a little odds and ends here. So stick around and watch our progress.
as you can see, this car's got no thermostat in it. It's got this, uh, this piece here. So he basically took a thermostat and gutted it. All kinds of theories about this stuff. Whether you need one, you don't need one, your shit runs hot, your shit don't. The way I always do it is I just run a stock thermostat. And there was a radiator guy that worked next to my dad's shop. Basically said that, you know, the whole goal of that thermostat is to keep the warm water in the block, open up, exchange the water that's in the radiator. And it's always worked for me to just use one. I know people use stuff without and it's fine, but you know, each person's got their own opinion. All right, Tess is gonna pick up a thermostat and why we're waiting on that. We're gonna go ahead and put the spark plugs in this thing, which should be fun. So we like NGK plugs. And uh, these deals already got anti-seize on them. So I'm just gonna go ahead and thread them in. than motherfucker in here so this is how i'm doing this just a three-quarter wrench with the spark plug socket so i can get in here and tighten this stuff up Plugs are in. Now we're gonna work on the car right here.
Turn me the saw on. I gotta get this fucker out. Somebody get the torch. <laughs> Mavericks maiden voyage. It's the real deal now. So that's almost like drift status. Huh? That shipper's almost like drift status. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna try this again.
still needs a couple things yet. What's left? What's left? Drive it. <laughs> Drive it, carpet, maybe a shifter, maybe. I don't know, kind of like that one. Lights in. Yep. Maybe a camshaft change. Yeah, definitely a camshaft change. Never get one. There's little odds and ends. It's came a long way, but it still needs some work, but it's Yeah, pop the trunk. So we're gonna wire the sending unit. Mount the relay. A lot of little stuff. Now, now Jay can get on his Falcon. Well, start it up. Right, you guys the Maverick is gone uh, they left took it today as you can see we went and rode in it went around the block 
there's a lot of stuff that I didn't film that just would be boring for some of you guys to watch, like figuring out wiring and mountain seats and finding bolts and stuff like that. We just decided it's crunch time. Let's get this thing running. My car trans needs to come out. It's leaking oil and it is Sunday and we're going fabulous Fords in a week. So I've got to get my trans out, fix the oil leak. I think it's the front the front deal where the input shaft goes through is leaking. So that's why I didn't film a lot of it. I want to just get the car done. And sometimes filming when you're trying to just press, press, press is hard to do. So uh, you guys got to see, you know, the basics, motor going in and out, stuff like that. So I hope you enjoyed that series and uh, stay tuned for the next stuff.